second question what are the types of energy and what in the lewis spectroscopy answer for this is already known in lewis spectroscopy only change in the electronic energy but second question what are the types of energy involved in the uv spectroscopy to solve this question take an example in uv spectroscopy suppose this is our any atom in the ground state after absorbing some energy it goes to the excited state okay this is the electron that mainly change occur in the uv spectroscopy but each electron energy contains the transitions of the vibrational energy it means electron energy contains the small small vibrational energy in them this is the vibrational energy that are present in the electron energy which also occur ground to the excited state it is ground state for the vibrational energy this is excited state for vibrational energy and vibrational energy contains the rotational energy it means vibrational contains again small small rotational energy each vibrational energy level contains the rotational energy level same that's why these what are the types of energy involved in the uv spectroscopy the answer is the or because simple one electronic energy level contain all that is vibrational also contain in vibrational there is a presence of rotational that's why the answer is the all the types of energy involved in the uv spectroscopy but which energy change if ask this question energy change only occurs in the electronic energy this is the simplest way to explain the principle of the uv spectroscopy and the relation of electronic energy and rotational and vibrational energy. then always the energy of electronic energy electronic energy is greater than vibrational and then vibrational is greater than rotational this relation is also important this is all about the uv spectroscopy for more pharma videos please subscribe our channel that is pharma doctors thank you